What if you could create PowerPoints within seconds? That is no longer a dream, that is reality, and today I'm going to show you exactly how you do it as well. My name is Johannes Sundlu, and I combine HR, working as a people director with doing stuff like this, educating people on how to use technology. And I've been fortunate enough to work with companies across the globe doing this as well. But I said, today we're going to talk about Microsoft Copilot and they released an updated version of their Microsoft Copilot last week and they call it Wave 2. And Copilot is the name of Microsoft's AI initiative, such as embedding AI into the office suite, for example, which is what we're going to talk about today. And wave two for Microsoft Copilot is so much more than just PowerPoint. But today I'm going to focus on PowerPoint because I think it's truly magic. So without further ado, I'm going to jump in and show you how you can create the PowerPoint within seconds. We have opened up PowerPoint. And as you can see here, here's the Copilot logo. If I click that, I get taken to the Copilot section of this as well. And here I can choose. I can choose to create a presentation about and then type myself, or I can also create the presentation from file. And I'll show you the other one here. Create the presentation from file. I have already prepared with a remote work policy that I've written as well. And we'll try to create the PowerPoint from based on that file, basically. So what we did here, we took a Word file that we had already, and then we said to PowerPoint, hey, can you create a PowerPoint presentation based on this file? And now it does exactly that. And here we go. Here we have the remote work policy and the presentation as well. And obviously it's not full fledged. I, I would obviously need to adjust this to make sure it looks nice. And you see the image here. I would probably do this, for example, make it a bit bigger for perhaps I would adjust this. But the outline of this is amazing. In seconds, I can take something that I already verified. This is my own policy. Use that as the backbone for this presentation, meaning that I can be quite certain at least that this is my thinking, my own policy, and then created a presentation based on that policy. But just to show you that you can also start from a blank canvas if you want to create something straight from the bat without having a pre-made policy or pre-made document somewhere, you can also just create with PowerPoint. Here we are within PowerPoint again. I've clicked the co-pilot button and then I'll click create presentation about and I type remote work policy. And now it will of course create a remote work policy here for me, I hope at least, but it won't be based on the specifics that I have. But just once again to show you that you'll actually get a result if you do this as well. If you need to create a PowerPoint in a fast fashion manner where you don't have that line up for you well you can still do that with powerpoint and here we are <laughs> it's quite meaty actually as you can see here as well you have the option to click designer here and that gives you the option to change you can also obviously change it to your own powerpoint style if you have a powerpoint style within your company as well but yeah it's quite fast and quite nimble the question is then how do you get these features well hit the like button and i'll tell you no, I will tell you anyway, but still hit the like button if you found this video useful. And then back to how do you get these features? First and foremost, you need to be a Microsoft customer. That kind of explains itself. But then you need to have a Microsoft 365 license of some sort. And that some sort is quite vague, I know, but still there's a link below here where you can see all the licenses where you can opt in to get the Copilot license because that is also something that you need to buy on top or what you're already buying from Microsoft. Meaning that, for example, if you're just a standard customer of Microsoft with the Microsoft 365 plan, you need your IT department or yourself if you're paying for yourself to buy that add-on license for Copilot. And Wave 2 isn't fully launched yet either. So I'm part of the early access program, so I have it. But in Europe, it will be launched 30th of September and in the US 12th of October meaning that you might have to wait a while in order to get access to this. But it's worthwhile the wait, because as I said initially, Copilot has been so-so for the Microsoft 365 suite, but now all of a sudden it actually makes sense, at least for me, to have it. And with that said, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.